In this video, I'll be helping you with a problem set called factoring out a monomial from a polynomial multivariate. We're asked to factor the following expression, and from this expression we can see that there are multiple variables, so that's the multivariate part. It's a polynomial in that it has two terms, in this case separated by subtraction, so it's a polynomial, and we're going to factor out of that a monomial. So to get us started, I'm going to look at the first values in each term, the coefficients, which are 26 and 16. So over on the side, I'm going to list out the factors of 26 and 16. 26 can be written as 1 times 26, 2 times 13, and that's it for our factors for 26. 16 can be written as 1 times 16, 2 times 8, 4 times 4. So the greatest common factor between those two numbers is 2. 2 is the largest factor of both 26 and 16. So that means on the number side I'm going to be able to factor out a 2 from the expression. But then I'm going to look at the variables and they both have a u. The first term has a u2, so it has two u's, and the second term has a u9. So that means that they both have at least two u's or u squared. Then I notice that they both also have a v. The first term has a v4, the second one has a v9. So they both have at least four v's. So I'll factor out a v4. The first term has some w's, but the second one doesn't. It's not a common factor, so I'm not going to be able to factor that out. Now that we've identified the monomial that we're going to be factoring out, we just need to find out what's left from each one of the terms that we're factoring out of. So if it's helpful, over on the side, we can write the first term and we can divide it by that common factor that we're taking out, the 2u squared v4. And when we do that, we can see that the 26 and the 2 are going to simplify to 13 the u squareds are going to completely cancel and the v4s are going to completely cancel leaving me with just the w3. So from the first term once I take out the 2u squared v4 I'm left with 13 w to the third power. Now for the second term we have that minus 16 u 9 v 9. If I divide that by the term that I'm factoring out, the 2u squared v4, the minus 16 divided by 2 is going to simplify to minus 8. The u9 and the u2, you can think of this as the u squared canceling two of those u's in the top. So I now have u7 left over. And for the v's, those four v's cancel four of the v's in the top, leaving me with v5. So my second term is minus 8 u7 v5. We have factored out the monomial. To check our answer, we could distribute that outer term back to each of those inner terms, and we should end up back at our original expression. So this is our expression with the monomial factored out. 